Hello again everyone and welcome back to the Latin Gamer. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to get to Musk Reef. And Musk Reef is a, a little secluded, secluded island on the outskirts of Cape Oath. That's on this um, territory in Monster region. So to get here, you have to take a, a portal from Cape Oath and I'll show you how to do that. And I'll also show you what you can get on this island if you've never been there. So if you've never been here, been there, this video is definitely for you. So I will show you how to get there and I'll show you how to maneuver this entire area when you get there. All right, everyone. So when you get to Cape Oath, you're actually going to go towards the end and your character is going to be drawn to the portal up there in the sky okay and the first thing you need to know is how to activate this wind updraft and i'll show you definitely um directly how to do that okay so when you're at this updraft all right you're going to have three of these um statues here and you know that to get the statues activated you have to help the little ghost things to get to where they need to go Right, you need to help them to find peace or help them on their journey or something. So to find the ghosts, they're actually going to be really easy to find. One is definitely going to be on top of that cliff. And the other is going to be somewhere over here. So you, they will be easily noticeable. If you can't find the last one, the last one will be hiding behind a tree. I think it will be either that tree up there or the trees over here. So don't forget that, alright? Because I had, a, I, had a tr um, I had some problems finding the last ghost. So, when you activate this updraft, all you need to do is just go inside and enter this portal right here. And that's how you easily come to Musgrave. If I should bring up the map right now, you will see that I'm currently at Musgrave. And what you need to do is this, when you activate this with your wind magic, it you will get a chest somewhere. And on this island, I already collected most of the items here or most of the loot. So you currently won't see anything. But I'll just quickly go over what else is here. You will have some monsters and some more loot on that side. And to go over there, you need to come here and activate these little wind, wind things or wind spirits. And also on top of that portal right here, you will have uh, animoculus. I think that's what it called. The things that you give to your, your wind god or the wind statue. And this is how you maneuver this area. You can either do that or you can just climb. Now this portal right here is actually for level 20 or adventure rank 20. I'm currently at adventure rank 17 so I won't be able to use it as yet. But as soon as I'm able to, I will make a video on that. Okay everyone, so a day or two later I am now back here on Musk Reef and I am currently adventure rank 21. So the thing is, I think this is called the Spiral Abyss as you can see here so if you actually reach like adventure rank 21 and you want to know what this is all about it's actually located on musk reef and i i think it's like some kind of dungeon system i'm not sure i'm actually going to test it out right now so this video might be a long one and another good reason to actually come and do this is because if you should check the people's choice award Nice to meet you. Uh, My name is Xiangling. I'm a chef from Liyue. My favorite place is the chicken. I mean, all right, the she's doing a little too much. At adventure rank 20, you actually can unlock Hello. Xiangling. So I think you have to reach Hello. like nice to floor meet you. three, My chamber three in the dungeon. So let's just get it started, everyone. A grand underground corridor which leads to an unknown spiral constructed. Whoa, it seems like I read too slow or something, but let's continue. Blessing of the Abyssal, abyssal Moon, um, Azura, 
Auras that increase your character's shield strength will occasionally appear during the battle. 13 day, 18 hours until the Abyssal Moon Spire resets. Okay. So I think you get Zhongling when you reach like here. But I like the, the fact that you can actually choose how you want to do them. So I guess like if you're not strong enough, you can leave and come back when you're stronger to like finish it. Treasures from the Abyss Corridor can only be obtained once. Clear floor 8 of the Abyssal Corridor to permanently unlock the Abyssal Moon Spire. I'm not sure what that is, but we are going to find out when we get there. So if I don't do it today, I will make a separate video on that later on. Okay, everyone? Pyro damage dealt by all party members increased by 75%. Overloaded, overloaded damage increased to two, by 200%. Alright, so... Let's just start. I don't really care about rewards. Um, Pyro. If I had this guy Bennett up to par, I probably would have used him. But I guess I'll take she. Um, definitely Noel, Mona, and because they are my strongest characters, so you can't expect nothing less. Let's start. The everlasting whisper of the spiral abyss encourages you to go deeper. Choose your benediction. Of the abyss character element burst damage 20% effective this first this floor um, when character HP is greater than 50% attack is 30% character movement speed 30% this is very tempting but I will take this one remain in challenge time longer than 90 seconds remain challenge time longer than 200 seconds oh I have to survive for 200 seconds to Actually, yeah. I think a good one to fight um, this thing, the yellow one, is actually her. No one escapes by because fire actually overloads him. Something like that. Damn, these things are annoying. Jam. Okay, I get you. So to get three stars, you have to have a lot of time left. Oh, so I didn't get three stars because... Okay. Yeah, let's continue to the next floor. So to actually get the max time, I'm probably just going to use my strongest attacks or this, this specific element. Oh, these things are annoying. up my my character selection because I'm used to Noel being on the the down key on the D-pad 
But she is actually not there. She's on the right key, I think. Quite a lot. Oh, here they are. Wait, did I just leave by accident? I think I hit the the circle key by accident. Let's go for more attack. More damage. Oops. Wait, what? That's a really fast way to destroy his shield. For those of you who don't know. Are you here to play with me? Over here! Boof! Over here! I think that should be a three star. There we go. Floor two. I'm probably not going to do floor two because you guys get the idea. So I am going to end this one here, everyone. Thank you all for stopping by, and I will definitely see you guys in the next one.